Hey, what's up guys? This is Nathan, and it's time for another exciting episode of Let's Play Harvest Moon for Super Nintendo, with an emphasis on a 900 or higher Ranch Master score. So, uh, with that said, let's get going. No typhoons tomorrow, which is good. Take care of our chickens first. Actually, we're not going to have an egg to give to Anne because we're going to be busy trying to hatch this here egg into another chicken. And we should have another chicken ready tomorrow. Um, remember, we're down one chicken because I had to sell one to get the cow. Because the stupid livestock dealer would not give us um, a chicken otherwise. Or not sell us a cow because we didn't have enough grass otherwise. Um, and I was complaining about it at the time. But uh, remember, you don't have to feed baby cows. But I was complaining about that at the time. But um, it did come to... Oh my goodness, we got tomatoes! Uh, it did make me start thinking... Um, him not selling us a cow. Uh, it made me start thinking that, uh, you know, we really probably do need to plant some more grass. So today while we're in town, I think we're going to buy up some grass and plant it. Yeah. That'll be the goal anyway. Also, I'm going to make an attempt to edit out, hopefully, uh, the crops. Even though, I guess since the tomatoes are ready, we're not going to have uh, that much watering to do, but I'm going to try to edit out, uh, watering the crops as best as I can. So, um, yeah, what you guys missed last time, while I was watching the video, making sure it worked okay, after I had made it and put it all together, um, I went on and continued playing, and I ended up harvesting, or harvesting, I ended up, uh, cutting enough wood for our house. So we never have to chop another stump of the entire game, except at one other point, and that's to get a special item. And I'll tell you guys about that later. Here you go, Ann. Love summer. Yes, it is hot. Trust me. All right. We'll see. There are actual points in the game um, at festivals. You guys may have already seen one at one of the festivals. I don't remember. Uh, but one where, uh, or an event where you can actually use the, try using the machine that she uh, has made. And if you do, it will blow up in your face and be kind of funny. But that's just a joke. Um, a running joke on the game. Yes, buy it. More grass. The longer we have the grass planted, the more we get off of it, which is good. And remember, we very slowly want to increase the maximum grass space on our land as is, because um, we want to get enough uh, grass to cover the entire farm, because that will raise our farm development rate. And uh, I know it may be boring, but I am going to actually show you guys um, tilling up uh, the field, everything uh, with that, because there is a power berry buried somewhere deep beneath the farm that we have yet to find. And uh, so we're going to dig and hopefully find it. We already found one under the farm, but there's another one waiting for us. And the sooner we get it, the better, because um, as it is, we don't quite have enough stamina, not quite, to water all of the crops uh, at once. So. Yeah. We might actually... This is looking good. We may be able to get all these if it doesn't turn bright colored like right now. Yep, there it goes. Maybe we won't get it all. Well, we'll see. It's 3 o'clock. I bet we'll get it all. We're going to be optimistic. Because we want to be. Gosh darn it. Tomorrow we'll have a ton of potatoes to harvest. Yeah, life's good. Just harvesting the crops. No, I mean... One more. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! We did it. Let's go, uh... Man, that was a good timing. We got good money. Let's go till up some land. And now that our summer crops are starting to come in, we're going to be doing good. Um, yeah, provided we don't get in a couple of bad typhoons. But we should be doing pretty good. So, um... Let's extend up, shall we? Come on, where's the power berry? Power berry. Is a mole! Ah, get the mole! Oh, he got away. That was close. That was dangerous. Power berry! I got the berry of power tree! Well, that was good. Man, found it pretty quick. Keep... Three, one. 
two, three. Okay, this is all we need for the crops we have now. Uh, yeah. And we'll extend out further as need be at the appropriate time. Well, with that said, I suppose there's not a lot of reason in you guys watching me do the rest of this. So from this point on, I will fast forward uh, to the next day. So, yeah. Okay, so we have skipped forward. Uh, we successfully got our power berry, and now we're going to keep going. So, oh, it's going to rain tomorrow. That's okay with me. You know why? It's not a typhoon. I don't like typhoons. Good dog. I don't. I hate them. They're evil. What day is it? Saturday! Can't do no business today. Hey, cow. Remember, we don't feed the cow, um, and we only talk to her and brush her once a day because that's all that we can do. Any additional brushing does essentially nothing um, towards her affection, and that's just the way the game is. That's the way the world is. Yeah. So, we will take an egg to Anne for our daily stuff. Yeah. And uh, then we will see how we're doing. Uh, we'll harvest as much as we can and see how we're doing then after that. Uh, but we got tomatoes ready! I'm so happy about the tomatoes! Now we start making money, guys. This is what it's all about. The money. That's what your whole life is about. The money. That alone. No, I'm just kidding. Seriously. Okay. There she is. There you go. No idea comes out under this heat. So you're saying you're too hot to think. Hmm. I think there's a little bit easier ways to get that point across. Simpler ways to say it. Oh well. Uh, so, oh, I got a funny story. Funny thing happened to me today during Oblivion. Um, yeah. I was doing this quest in the game, and, um... Part of the, the the point of the quest is I'm supposed to find this vampire guy and kill him, and I'm going through this cave. And if you haven't played Oblivion, um, you may not know exactly what I'm talking about. But uh, I'm going through this cave, and um, look, there's vampires in it, and there's these ghosts, and we're not going to get everything, but that's okay. There's vampires, and there's ghosts, and there's um, like banshees or wraiths or something like that. And I'm going through and I'm killing all these guys and I get to the very end and I'm right at like the, in the last room, about to come up on the last room where the boss is. And I'm trying to sneak in, you know, there's there's like some wraiths in there with him. I'm trying to sneak in and um, and, and kill him sort of, you know, on the side. How much time we got? And we're going to push it. Anyway, I'm trying to sneak in, you know, pull, pull, the, pull the wraiths and the ghosts out and kill them so I don't have to fight multiple enemies at once. And uh, I'm walking up on the room, and I look in there, and I see the wraiths are fighting someone. And um, I just sit there and I watch. I'm like, well, this is fine. I'll wait for them. I figured there were other vampires in there protecting him, too. I'm like, well, this is fine. I'll wait for them to kill these other vampires, and that's just lest I have to kill them uh, once I actually get through the game. And uh, I'm sitting there watching, and then all of a sudden this message pops up on the screen that says, uh, I've, I've killed so-and-so, this vampire guy I'm fighting. Um, I better go back to so-and-so and tell him that I did it. And, like, my mission was completed then. Which is funny, because, um, I didn't actually kill, uh, the vampire. So, I thought it was pretty hilarious. But, um, yeah, that's just me. Ah, uh, good timing. We weren't holding one. Wow, we got good money. Man, we're gonna upgrade our house in no time. So, guys, I'm gonna try, uh, once again... I'm going to cut out uh, the watering part, so I will see you shortly. Hopefully this will work out well. Bye bye What's up, guys? I'm back. And I just realized I left my poor dog outside in the rain, so... Uh, and it's raining tomorrow, too. That's okay, because it's not a typhoon. Let's go rescue our dog. Not that this really makes any huge, major, massive difference uh, in the game, but... It's just nice, because we love our dog. Isn't that right? Who's a good boy? Oh, are you a good boy? Yes, you are. Okay. So, let us go and take care of our animals. We'll do cow first. Hi, cow. 
Hi, Nathan. Oh, don't feed it. Almost fed it. Good girl. Yes. Okay. Chickens. And I'm willing to bet there's probably some grass ready to be cut today. No promises, though. So we'll uh, we'll follow our usual routine. Actually, I don't remember. This will be a learning experience. I don't remember if they actually have church when it rains or not. I think they might actually cancel church when it rains, which is kind of funny. Um, yeah. But, oh well, these people look for an excuse not to go. Let's, uh, let's see if we can take something to Anne. If, if they don't, if the church is actually closed, then, I don't know, maybe Maria will be there and we can give it to her. Um, not closed, but if there's nothing, there's nothing going on in the church here. Yeah, look, they cancel church for the rain. Maria is not here, though. I'm not giving it to him because it makes no difference whether or not he likes us. So... Let's uh, check on Maria. And it's locked. Okay, well, let's go back and sell this. Because uh, that's 50 gold. We're not wasting it. Yeah. And there you go. Let's get as many... Yeah, we can get the rest of these tomatoes. And then water... We still have to water it. But oh well. We are doing incredible on money. Things are looking good. Um, so, yeah. We water these, and all the tomatoes should be together. It really bothers me if you have, like, some in one uh, cluster that are not together. And uh, I know it shouldn't, but that's just my OCD. Nom, nom, nom. Okay. And refill this, and let's see if we can cut some grass, and uh, then we'll call it a night. Because there's not much more we can do. It looks like some grass is ready. All right. Well, this is good if uh, if this editing it out works. Um, I'm assuming if you're watching this, it has worked, uh, and the videos worked fine. But no, it's not ready. What about you? You ready? No. Okay. Anyway, um, it'll be good because we can get three episodes in in a in a game in one day, and that'll be uh, one episode. And three days in in an episode. Wow. What am I saying? Three, uh, three days in an episode, and uh, it'll work well. Yep. Well, guys, I suppose that's about it. So, um, with all this said, I will leave you now, bid you farewell, um, and I will see you next time. So thanks a lot for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, comment, uh, give me ideas and suggestions, what to do to make this fun and interesting for you guys. And... Um, if you have some time, go over and check out my friends at Harvest Moon Paradise. They're actually doing a really cool uh, giveaway, uh, an art contest. If you win the art contest, you, can, you win a copy of Tale of Two Towns, a new Harvest Moon game, either for DS or 3DS. Uh, you get to choose. And so I'm terrible at art, and I'm going to enter it just for fun. But anyway, uh, go on over, check out my friends there, and I will see you next time. So until, until then, stay frosty.